Michael Vick is known to be the most dominant player in Madden's history, and today I'm attempting to scramble for a 99-yard touchdown with him in every Madden he's ever been in, starting back here all the way in Madden 02. Now the problem is scrambling in these old Maddens is actually pretty difficult. You have to press like two or three buttons to even start to scramble. And at least we got like 10 yards on the first play. It's just gonna be so hard to like remember like subconsciously what buttons to press when. Like look at this dude, we're barely even getting out of our own end zone. Even though Michael Vick's overall is gonna get super high throughout his career, for starters as a rookie, he's only a 72 overall and doesn't even have 90 speed yet. Like Michael Vick under 90 speed, that's blasphemous. 53 awareness, 85 agility, and 84 acceleration. Like this is gonna be impossible. How am I supposed to scramble for a 99 yarder with this? Yeah dude, 72 overall as a rookie when I don't even know really how to scramble well. This seriously is gonna be like the hardest challenge I've ever tried to complete. You'll notice that now we only have 10 lives remaining, and if we can score with Michael Vick before I run out of lives, I get to steal any teammate of Michael Vick's from Madden 2002 and add them to the current day Falcons, which I must mention is led by Michael Vick himself. At the very end, we're gonna sim a season with the team that we've built, and if our new look Falcons Michael Vick led team doesn't at least win their division, I have to discard 5, yes 5, of Michael Vick's highest rated Madden cards. Bro, that is over a million coins worth of Michael Vick's! I might end up undergoing kidney failure today with all my precious mutt coins on the line. So, like, he doesn't even seem that fast. Like, what in the world am I supposed to do? Like, maybe I should just wait for my blockers and just be patient with it. Nah, dude, like, this is not going well. So, again, if I can just stay patient and just, like, wait for, like, the defense to bite, like, what in the world is going on? Michael Vicko! Oh my god, bro, I thought I just actually entered the Matrix. Now for today's side quest, if we don't upgrade Michael Vick's New Age Falcons to an 87 overall team, I have to lower his overall by 10 from 99 to 89, and we can't be having that because this team might not even be good enough to make the playoffs even with the 99 rated QB leading the attack. Oh my gosh, too much pressure. So I have to press X, then press Y again and run away from the bad boys. Like, hold on a second. Like, these are the most insane five-yard runs I've ever seen. Things should end up getting easier once he gets to, like, a 90 overall. Like, what do I do, bro? Like, we're fumbling now. What if he scores? All right, like, what do I do, man? Like, this is the most complicated thing I've ever had to achieve. Oh, my God, Michael, go! Michael, go! We have three men to make miss? Oh, he tripped us up, but at least we do see there is potential. Like, these linebackers are, like, the fastest men I've ever seen in my life. There is so much space. There is so much space. Michael, Vick, go! Oh my god, bros, like, I swear to you, I feel like this is possible, but at the same time, the hardest thing I've ever had to do. If we don't happen to score before we run out of lives, luckily I get to reset back up to 10. But if we score in that instance, I can only steal a player from Michael Vick's team that's an 85 overall or below. And obviously, I'd welcome every improvement we can get. But keep in mind, I've got to find a way to build a Super Bowl quality bulletproof squad. I wanted to pause the action for a brief moment to tell you guys about the easiest way to get in on the NFL action. And that'd be with Underdog Fantasy and their pick'em game. Underdog Fantasy is literally the best place to play fantasy sports. And with their pick'em game, you just pick higher or lower on your favorite or least favorite player stats, and you could win and 20 extra money in a single night. And Underdog always keeps it super simple with their easy to use website and mobile apps. You can pick between two to five players to fill out your pick'em entry, and if you get every pick right, you'll be taking home some well-deserved cash. And unfortunately, with my Titans out of the playoffs, I had to give some love to the team that did knock us out of the playoffs. The Jags, I have higher on Trevor Lawrence, Travis Etienne, and Evan Ingram. Also gave some love to the Niners, although I went lower on Kyle. And you can sign up to Underdog by clicking the link in the description box below. And make sure you use code RBT to get your first deposit doubled up to $100. Once again, massive shout out to Underdog for sponsoring today's video. Hold on a second. Michael Vick, go. Michael Vick, go. Go, go. That's a fast boy. Michael Vick, please, dear God. I actually beg you. I beg you to break the tackle. Break a second. He does it. Oh my God, dude. We got so freaking close! I forget what buttons to press, bro. Maybe that was the right one. Michael Vick to the outside. Michael Vick, go! Please, dude, please break some tackles. Michael Vick! Oh my god, let's go! Michael Vick in the flesh!
taking his presence field in the National Football League. Oh my god, dude. All of those attempts led up to that. Like, it was such a long play that the instant replay only caught up with us about halfway through, but at least it got the good part. Holy crap! So I'm allowed to steal literally any of his teammates, and why not just go ahead and get him a franchise left tackle? Let's welcome Bob to the squad. Offensive line already looking so much better. But if I want this team to be bulletproof, we need to add so much more. We really need to give Michael Vick some more weapons on offense. Come on, hopefully year number two, Michael Vick is a little bit better. At least we don't have to press 65 buttons to scramble. But it looks like at least we got out of the end zone first attempt. Michael Vick, can we score attempt number one? Not quite, but that was super promising. At least his overall went up a little bit in Madden 2003, up to a 78 overall. But unfortunately for us, his speed went down 1 to 88. Like, how, dude? It's Michael freaking Vick. At least he got some pretty big improvements on his agility and acceleration, though. So at least in this Madden, all I have to do is press one button, and now I can sprint. But, like, the linebackers are so fast. Like, oh, no. Let's just take off. We got this one man we have to beat. Okay, the spin move's pretty nasty. It really is. I don't know what his spin move rating is, but it seems pretty disgusting. Like, it is kind of crazy how elusive you can get with the QB, but, like, like, you see how many men I just made miss? And if I can get out of my way, bro, if I can score this, it's going to be the craziest thing I've ever seen. It's just, like, not possible, is it? Michael Vick. This would, that, that was the most insane 15-yard scramble I've ever seen. At least now I can focus on actually scrambling and not what buttons I'm having to press. Like, it's just so weird how this game feels. I think it's feeling really good. I think I'm feeling really good. Michael Vick, you got to outrun this guy. Who in the world is that? I'm depressed. Depression. Of all people, I would expect to 100% guarantee outrun somebody in a foot race. It'd be Michael Vick. Now we can't get out the end zone. Like, I just don't know if it's better just to, like, take this guy on one-on-one -on -one and try to beat everybody else or, like, wait in the end zone and, like, try to be Houdini or something. Like, that's nice and all, but I still needed, like, 65 more yards. I'm not gonna lie, it's so confusing in these Maddens when the sprint button is X and not the trigger. So, like, do I even have potential here? Like, it's easy to make guys miss until they come out of nowhere and sack you in the end zone. Like, imagine the scenes we actually walk this off once again. Like, just run, Michael. Broken tackle. Spin move. Run over him! Oh, no, it comes down to the last attempt. Like, if I can make this guy miss, there's a little bit of potential here. Michael Vicko, there's no way we did it again. There's no way we did it again. We did. No, dude, I thought there was so much promise there. It's okay, though. I will gladly take myself an 85 rated player below. Like, the Falcons team that we currently have needs every player possible. Where did you come from, bro? Oh my, please, nobody catch me. This would be the most insane thing I've ever seen in my life. Please block, 84. It's always easy to make miss. But these guys aren't as easy, please, please, please. Broken tackle, Michael, go, please, bro. I'm actually begging, I'm actually begging. After that last play, 21, get away from me, Michael Vick, let's go! I swear to you, bro, I had lost all freaking hope. But it's impossible to lose all hope when you're controlling Michael Vick, the legend. So I must steal a player 85 or below, and I'm pretty sure Keith Brooking is the ideal candidate. Let's welcome our brand new defensive captain. Keith Brooking was much needed, bro. Our inside linebacker depth was horrible. We've got to aim to add more defensive players, though, because this defense is pretty stinky. And would you look at who's on the cover next season? Arguably the most dominant player in any Madden ever, Michael Vick, 95 overall with 95 speed now, 95 agility. Hopefully we can score 99 yarder quick so we can steal any of these players. And would you believe it, the first ever designed QB run in Madden history, and it's going to get us... A solid 15 yards to start. If any Michael Vick today is going to score on one of the first few plays, it's going to be the Madden 2004 Michael Vick. Got some good blockers. He breaks a tackle. Michael Vick, go! Speak of the devil, the 40, the 50, please. There's nobody that's going to catch up with 95 speed Michael Vick. Casper the Ghost, please don't show up. Michael Vick, touchdown, boom! I told you guys this man was the most dominant quarterback in Madden history. We get to steal anybody off this roster, and unfortunately, I can't get the 94 version of Keith Brooking, but I will get myself a 92-rated defensive player to steal. Let's welcome Patrick, the new anchor to our defensive line. We are up to an 81 overall now, 81 offense, 83 defense. Keep in mind, that has got to reach 87 by the end of the day, or this Michael Vick loses 10 overall. It's like we seriously have our work cut out for us today. We're in a dogfight.
Spy. Vic did dip a little bit in Madden 05. Down to a 92, but still has 94 speed. Gosh, they change the buttons up on me all the time. And yay, great start. We get five. As you can tell, we're actually going to try and scramble this time. We finally got to set the defense to a random play, so I have no say in what the defense calls. Michael Vick go! Michael Vick go! There's no way we did that in the second attempt. There's no freaking way. Michael Vick. Oh my god, dude. Stop celebrating. Touchdown. Let's go! The celebration slowed him down. It scared me. So again, I get to steal anybody off the Falcons squad. I think I'm going to go with Ron Coleman, though. You never turn down a defensive tackle name. Rod. Oh, I think our defensive line is now set to go. Like, imagine we can actually get some better safeties. We can actually build ourselves a half-decent defense. I really hope Michael Vick has some good wide receiver teammates eventually that we can add, because right now, this score is pretty stinky. I don't think his overall changed at all in Madden 06. Hopefully that means we score again. Oh no! They changed up the scrambling again! Okay, all we do is press sprint now, but we have so many raiders in the vicinity and we get sacked play one. That's a great start. At least I don't have to operate a helicopter just to get my quarterback to scramble. Although it doesn't look like the current option makes things even easier. We can't even get out the end zone. Can I just get a positive yard for once? Like, the defensive players are just so fast. We can just catch them on a blitz and we get outside. Maybe there's a chance. Nasty little spin move, and we fumble. Jesus, hold on to the ball, Michael. Oh, gosh. Like, where in the world do I go here? Like, maybe we can get this hole? We do. This would be insane. This would be absolute insanity, and we ran out of freaking stamina. That was so poetic and so anticlimactic at the same time. Boys, we're starting to get the crunch time. It's getting to the point where we need an absolute miracle, and we can't even get out of our own end zone. Come on, Michael. You're going to have to make a big play eventually. We got green grass here. Spin move. Okay, Michael, go. Please, bro. Nobody catch up to me. Please do not run out of stamina. Is that Charles Woodson? Charles Woodson, no. No. He dove a miss. Let's go. Miracles still happen. Charles Woodson was literally this close to tackling me. I think Charles might have actually made physical contact, but Michael's body said not today. So again, we can steal any Atlanta Falcon teammate that we want to, and I think I'm going to make a decision that might be controversial. But at the same time, I don't want to pass up on a 93 rated tight end. There was zero chance I was passing up on a talented tight end named Algie Crumpler. I don't necessarily think Crumpler and Kyle Pitts makes a too terribly bad tight end duo. I mean, that's nice and all, but we still need good wide receivers. We're only up to an 82 overall team, man. Somehow, some way, I've got to give this up to an 87. No, an 07, he's steadily going down and overall down to a 91. Even his speed impacted down to a 93. So I'm foreshadowing a future potential problem. If I do get to steal any of Michael Vick's Atlanta Falcon teammates here, I'm going to have a really hard time passing up on a guy named Todd Wiener. Yo, this is the first time that I actually get to scramble out of a five wide formation. It's the first time it's been in the game and I'm smiling. I just don't know like oh my god, dude The Hail Mary is wide open there. So if you could just like block down the field for me like that's a decent attempt There's just no way it's that simple. There is no way he dove and missed again. I think we actually did it I mean 91 speed is still pretty freaking nasty. Why did you stop? Why did Michael Vick just dug it? He still scored but Michael I hope that was worth it, bro I about had a heart attack man literally stopped to do the Dougie in the middle of a 99 yard scramble for a touchdown dude like what? What do I do? Like, who in the world should I steal? Like, do I pass up on Todd Wiener? I think I'm gonna have to because I really can't pass up on a Hall of Fame DB. Let's give a warm welcome to one of the best to ever play this game. With how dire our safety situation was, I could not pass up on Lawyer Malloy, man. Like, this defense is literally insane. I think it's time that we start building back the offense again, though. So I'm not too entirely sure why, but Michael Vick did decide to take a couple years off from football, and he comes back two years later later as an eagle he went from a 90 to a 73 overall still has 90 speed though but with just a few years off of football his overall literally dipped by 17 i'm afraid this challenge is about to get super difficult again i can't believe it in the time he's been gone they actually added qb draw to the playbook that might actually make things easier for us. There's no way he doesn't play number one. Okay, that's fair. You've been out the league for two years. I mean, Michael Vick with the QB draw really might end up being a cheat code. I mean, we only need about 96 more yards. Come on, bro. I want to be able to steal anybody I want to off the Eagles. It's a fresh slate of players to pick from. If we can just catch the Chiefs defense in like the right setup, there's potential. But uh, for now, we just need to focus on getting out of our own end zone. Come on, you still have 90 speed, man. Show us what we've missed in the football world. Come on, Vick, get the edge. Spin move. 
Hey, it's a face mask. Do I get a free play? Where's my Falcons, Michael Vick? This Eagles one's a Mickey Mouser. I want his Falcons version back. This Eagles Vick is like the Wish version. Nice block, though. Oh, my God. That very well might have been a block in the back. But Michael Vick, why does he seem so slow, bro? Go, please. There's nobody in the vicinity unless, unless Casper the Ghost comes out of nowhere. Michael Vick, boom! We actually did it again at the death. Now, I can steal anybody off the Eagles here, but I have to be smart about it. Boys, it is time for a brand new running back in Atlanta. There is no way we have a backfield consisting of Michael Vick and Brian Westbrook. And we also, don't forget, have Cordero Patterson, too. Like, that is stupid. Hopefully, that elusive backfield will make up for the fact that we have no real talent at wide receiver. Same overall for him in Madden 11, and I think his speed even went down again. I mean, 91 Excel, 89 agility, and 88 speed isn't horrible for a 30-year-old. So we're actually gonna let Madden 11 Michael Vick run read option, and we got out of the end zone. That's a good start. Another broken tackle. What is what is going on? Michael Vick all the way down to the 30 on play number one? What the frick? So, Michael Vick with another broken tackle. This time can't get out of his own end zone. Defensive end crashed in there. We broke a tackle. Can we break like a second and third? I mean, kind of, but we ran out of bounds. Like is Madden 11 Michael Vick the best runner of all time? I mean, that's a nice little spin move. There's nobody else. Actually, there's one guy. Can we make one guy miss? Break one more tackle. The spin move is disgusting. The 25. We're actually going to do it, boys. Let's go. Michael Vick might actually be a better runner as an eagle than he was a falcon. There's a couple really smart options that we could steal here. There is literally zero planet where I could pass up on Asante Samuel again. We're pairing him with AJ Terrell. And keep in mind, we already have Lawyer Malloy at safety. Like, who's going to be able to throw on this defense? This time, going to run him on a simple QB power and uh didn't go as well as last madden should be easier this go around though he was a 73 last madden this time he's a 93 we can't even get out the end zone i mean i guess just some maddens end up being harder than others even though he's 20 overall higher dude come on michael show us what you're made of show us that 31 year old Vic can still make some moves can't break tackles though this really is not looking too good we can't get past the 10 come on michael i mean we can make this guy miss. We did. Michael Vick to the races, please. 30. Do not catch up. Another dive and a miss, please. Why was the players on the sideline grave, man? I about ran out of bounds, but I don't really care. I'm just kind of confused. Who on earth is Michael Vick's teammates? I think, my friends, there's absolutely zero doubt what we're going to steal this year. Deshaun Jackson is literally exactly what we needed. Michael Vick finally has a number one receiver, now paired with youngster Drake London. This Deshaun Jackson edition literally just made this team so much better. Not going to lie, Madden 13 an 89 overall for a 32 year old is still super strong i'm telling you guys right now madden 13 is giving me more trouble than any other game i've ever played and i swear to god i can tell you right now i'm the happiest man in the entire earth i swear to you bro if i didn't score in the first play there i was gonna cry everything is invisible i don't even know how to change the menus i assume q means quit yeah bro get me out the freaking game at least i can read the player's name so i can make a smart decision on who i want to steal and i think i know exactly who that is welcome our brand new number 69 slots right in at left guard now this offensive line is almost bulletproof probably need to get better than a 69 rated center oh no the michael vick crash is happening in madden 25 down to an 81 overall but at least he still does have 92 speed well too bad in madden 25 it doesn't look like there are lines on the field but we're still gonna try our absolute greatest and it was a decent little first attempt. At least I could actually figure out this Madden how to respot the ball down to the one. Come on, Michael Vick. Get me out of this predicament. This might actually be it. Now, the problem is I don't know where the out-of-bounds start, so I'm just going to stay forward. I'm going to stay forward. Nobody's going to catch up to 33-year-old Michael Vick, and that's another dub. So, stealing a player off of this roster is actually super tough. Like, I don't know which way to go. We actually stole D'Amico Ryans, our brand-new number one at middle linebacker. Like, the only other things we could add to this defense, potentially, is another outside linebacker and a free safety. Don't forget, I need to build an absolute Super Bowl bulletproof squad. No, in Madden 15, he's in New York jet and for the first time in like 10 seasons under an 80 overall not only do we not have lines again this year we have to play from the all 22 view which i have a better view of the field there's just no way again oh my god bro that would have been amazing i'll tell you right now i'm just like not a fan of this view at all man michael vick please man get me out of this game like i can see down the field better but that's about it this might actually end up being the first time in a while we haven't scored a touchdown hey man this one's coming down to the wire and i'm not used to that with michael vick although 
here. Although here, Michael Vick, go. Please block for me. One more man. Make a miss. Break the tackle. Michael Vick, go. Oh my god, bros. I thought that was it. Michael Vick, we're going to need an absolute miracle, brother. And that's not it. There's absolutely zero chance that we walk this off with the New York Jets version of Michael Vick. We got a good downfield block. We seriously need to block one man. Michael Vick, there's no way. I honest to God, don't know where the out of bounds is. I think we're going to score, though. I think we're going to score. That's the end zone. Boom! Bro, that's the most electrifying thing we've had happen all day. We can steal any one of these New York Jets, and I'm going to try and just make sure I make the smartest decision possible. We had to give Michael Vick another wide receiver to target. Now he's got Deshaun Jackson, Drake London, and Eric Decker. In Madden 16, he's all the way down to a 75, like the lowest he's been since his second year in the league and he's now a stealer and now that he's 35 85 speed is the lowest he's had his entire career michael i know you only have 85 speed this madden but this is your swan song so show them that you still have what it takes they're blitzing both of their safeties if we can get outside of them which i don't think we can Oh my god, this does not look good. Like this is not the Michael Vick that we all know and love. Um, the blocks down the field. A couple broken tackles, but we can't even get past the 10. Hold on. They literally blitzed everybody the right side of the field. If we can block, get past a couple tacklers, and we don't. But at least for once, we get past the 10. At least we didn't get stopped for a safety. Still breaking tackles. Couldn't break the third though. Absolute miracles are needed. His spin move is pretty nasty, but that's about it this season. Down to three lives. This is just really unheralded territory for Michael Vick. Like, it's kind of sad to see. So they're literally blitzing everybody. At least we got outside of them. Michael Vick just sprint. We get past one guy. Antonio Brown, hold on to your block, please. One man we need to miss. The spin move. We're completely out of stamina. Oh my god, there's no way we do this once again. At the death, the 10, the 5. Michael Vick officially is a legend. This man literally just went for 99 yards as a 35-year-old. Oh gosh, do I do the smart thing or do I do the dumb thing? I'm gonna be dumb. There was no way I was passing up on a 99 overall receiver. Who needs a good center? The finished offense is absolutely insane. And you can say the same exact thing about the defense. And we did it back complete our side quest we brought their team up to a 90 overall 92 offense and an 89 defense moment of truth there is absolutely no way a 90 overall team doesn't end up winning their division i don't want to have to lose a million coins worth of michael vick cards Boom! let's go 14 and 3 we got a first round bye my mike coins are officially safe i mean that's a pretty nasty season from michael ryan westbrook went off and michael vick didn't quite have a thousand yards on the ground but that's not bad for a qb his receivers did what they had to do you have got to be kidding me. Michael Vick has got to prove the NFL wrong by ending off with a Super Bowl ring. Boom! A Super Bowl win. What a way to cap things off. And yo, look at who won Coach of the Year. Now, if you enjoyed that one, click right here to watch me score a touchdown with Patrick Mahomes in every Madden he's ever been in.